something just broke brush big time in the swamp right there. Whatever it was, it was big. It was big. It evidently saw me before I saw it. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that was. It was loud. And it was big. I just got done um, taking some photographs and I didn't have it on video. I was just starting to start my hike again. Something in this area right here, it was loud. It was loud. It scared the bejeebers out of me. Right up inside there. Right in there. It was loud. It was like literally like a horse. You know, it was just like whatever it was, it was that big. It just broke through the brush and gone. I don't know what it was. We do have bear, so I mean it could be a bear, but whatever it was, hopefully I see it on film because I can't see over these over these uh trees and bushes. Whatever it was, it was big, but it didn't run far. I guarantee it only ran probably five, ten yards and stopped. Because I could hear it the whole time and then just stopped. I mean, just literally stopped. That was crazy. That was crazy. I wish I was filming at the time, but that's how it happens. That's my luck every single time something happens and I'm not filming at the time. I'm too busy looking at something else or doing something else. I don't know what it was. What is that? crazy all right well moving on guys so I'm almost done with my hike this morning it was uh it was pretty interesting uh came at the right time it's just the humidity was low temperatures upper 70s maybe right around 80 so it was pretty nice um got a good hike in got a few miles there's an area I wanted to check where in past videos, I came up, came across this pond, and uh, I wanted to go completely around it. I want to check everything around it. Um, earlier in the video, you'll see where um, I found some possible prints. Um, it, it's just a when it rains, it's a double-edged sword. Um, either the rain's going to cover up what you could have possibly found the next day, or it creates an environment where fresh prints can be found. So I think what I found was stuff that got rained on. So it wasn't really clear. It wasn't, you know, it could have, you know, I took pictures and some video of it, um, just a document, but there's no telling. Um, found a couple of tree breaks, um, which is common, you know. I, I know some people want to claim, I found some weird ones that absolutely i i could not explain but i can't i can't say that all tree breaks are sasquatch related or anything like that or skunk ape related um sometimes it's a mother nature does things and it is what it is um but uh probably about 20 minutes ago on the head and back um i was going down this trailhead and on one side i got a pine forest 
on the other side I have a swamp and um, on the swamp side something I don't know what it was just broke brush just right through the through the brush and only it lasted a couple seconds I don't think they got very far and whatever it was it it ducked down it just took cover um, it was loud enough and it was loud enough to, to spook me um, it was pretty loud it was I think in the video I compared it to like a horse whatever it was it was big it wasn't like a person trying to run through the brush or a rabbit or, or a deer it was whatever it was um, it had some it had some size to it so I don't know what it was I did not see it all I heard was the brush that was it just this bulldozer effect something going through the woods um, I wasn't filming at the time I was actually you'll see the photograph I saw this really nice looking spider web and I wanted to take a picture of it and uh, it was right when I took the photo and I took it off camera and then I turned and took maybe just a couple strides when this thing just took off busted busted through I think it whatever it was it saw me way before I, I, I was able to, to uh, see it which I didn't so whatever his goal was he accomplished it whatever it was if it wasn't to be seen he didn't get seen um, if it was to not be heard he failed because I heard him breaking brush so but uh, that was pretty much it um, beautiful morning seen some deer stuff like that um, like I said we, we had some torrential down downpours last night um, it rains a lot it's that time of the year and it was torrential I'm talking huge huge drops I mean it was just torrential rains so like I said it's a double-edged sword I either came out and I was gonna find something fresh or I was gonna find something that was just obliterated by the rain so um, but I wanted to beat the humidity I want to beat the heat so I got here really really early in the morning because the last few times I've gone out it just it drains you you're just done I mean it's it's hot it's hot triple digits here in South Florida triple digits um, but that's about it um, it was a good time I enjoyed the hike put in quite a few miles um, but uh, I'm gonna head back and uh, you know drink some water and uh, get to the house and relax but uh, again I want to thank you guys um, we get a lot of wonderful feedback um, you guys are awesome. Our subscribers are fantastic. Me, Jimmy, Mike, and Bobby, we're, we're appreciative. Um, you know, we, we definitely uh, put our subscribers first. You know, it's whatever you guys want us to do. You know, give us suggestions. If, you know, um, we like hearing your stories. We like, like talking to you guys. So uh, continue being great because that's what you are. You're great subscribers. Um, YouTube channel is, is doing great. Um, like I said, it was... Not something that we had planned on. It was just something that we just did to, to really compile our videos. Because um, you can only keep them in so many locations. And I was, weird things was happening where things were disappearing on my on my systems for no reason, just disappearing. So um, the YouTube channel was created as a place to put these things so they don't get taken. They don't get, they don't disappear. That's what started it. Um, but we're up to like, I don't know 160 subscribers which I'm fine with um, you know everybody's we're not monetize, monetizing so if we have 150 or 3050 um, it doesn't change what we do it doesn't change how we're gonna go about things um, there are some goals that we want to accomplish in the future with YouTube um, but it's nothing as far as um, trying to get rich <laughs> you know I mean, we all have our day jobs that's what we do um, you know squatching it's just a hobby it's, it's us getting out in the woods we've all had encounters sightings stuff like that that's what draws us back out here that's what brings us into the woods um, but uh, I'm like everybody else I'm just Joe Blow um, I get scared out here I get the jeebies you know I get spooked um, sometimes I wake up and I go on why am I doing this why am I going out in the woods by myself at this time of day you know but we do we get out there we push ourselves and uh, we look around and um, you know because we know it exists that's what that's the motivator you know you you question yourself but then you lay your head down you go God, I know this thing's there I you know there's 
you know, believers, knowers, and non-believers. And, you know, our guys are knowers. We know it's there. And, um, you know, that's what just gets us up and gets us out there. So, um, sorry, I'm always looking around, you know. It's a uh, habit. Um, but it's a nice view if you can see that. It's this pond behind me just, you know, really pretty out here. Um, very quiet. Nobody's out here. That's why I like to get out here. There's nobody, nobody out here, so. Uh, which is good, but uh, if something happens to me, it's not so good. So, um, that's about it. Beautiful day. Um, I'll get this all together. I am doing the backpack cam a lot more. I've been putting those videos up. Um, they're unedited. You know, it's I just run up that, that that camera at 30 minute increments each time. And it's just watching things behind me. That's it. Um, I do that because I've been advised by, you know, other other um, researchers in the field. And they said, uh, you know, I would have caught this if I had a camera on my back. Or um, some of them think that they, they'll poke out and look at you as you go by. Or, you know, anything can happen behind you. Um, so I started putting my uh, body cam on the back of my backpack while I'm walking. So, um the video seemed to be uh, doing pretty well, so I'll continue to do that. You'll have these videos, which is forward shooting view and and stuff like that. And uh, but the back cam, it's it's that you're the researcher on that. Um, I don't edit them. I don't I don't do anything with them. I just I might go back and watch them. I might not, but I post them regardless. I post them. Um, that's why I'm hoping that since you know I just thought of that. I was running my backpack cam when that thing broke brush so um i may go back and review that to see if it, it picked it up because the body cam is great um but it doesn't have the uh sound recording quality to, but uh, hopefully it caught it and if it did um you guys will hear it that'll be a very interesting thing to to check out um you'll hear it it just breaks brush it's whatever it is it's it's loud um i just thought of that you know um, but I'll continue to post the backpack cam and of course these videos and stuff like that um, It's mostly bring you guys for the ride I know some of you guys can't get out or you live in areas where you don't have the opportunity um, You come along come along with me and uh, we'll walk these trails uh, We'll break brush and uh, see what we find together um, We don't uh, We don't uh, keep anything I mean we'll, we'll share whatever we find and uh, you know we just enjoy having you guys and uh, we some we really uh, thank you for your support and uh, you know give us some just suggestions you know uh, hit me up you can uh, I have uh, you can uh, direct message us we'll give you our email and you can contact us if you want to give us a sighting you want to say anonymous or um, if you want to get together, if you want to um, talk to us and find out the areas that we go to and you want to join us, you know, we'd be more than happy to have you come out and join us and have some fun in the woods. You know, like I said, it's a hobby. It um, gives us exercise, gets us out in the woods, and there is nothing better than being out in the woods. It, nature is amazing. And, uh, it's, and then you get that opportunity, the rare chance in the world to uh, see one if you do and and uh, but if not if you didn't enjoy yourself being out in the woods then there's something wrong with you um, I enjoy coming out here you know not a big fan of being by myself but uh, um, still do it get out here and uh, check things out you know I've got roughly 12,000 acres here I probably have not even touched 5% of it 5% there's, it's just, just so massive and when you're by yourself that's a lot of hiking Keep getting a knock over here. So, but, um, you know, like I said, it's all about you guys. Um, um, hit us up, you know, if you want to come out with us. Just uh, direct messages. Um, we have some things coming up in October. I'm not going to go into details right now, but it's going to be exciting. I'm excited about it. I can't wait. going to take a couple vacation days and uh, 
Um, we're going to do something that's exciting. Um, we just don't want to put it out there right now. Um, but as we get closer, um, you guys will, you know, uh, be notified on what we're doing. So October, look forward to October, you know, mid October. All right, guys. Well, that's it for me. I am going to load up my stuff and I've got probably maybe a half a mile hike still to go to get to my truck. And I am very, very thirsty, so I'm going to go get some water and head home. All right, guys, God bless you, and uh, get out in the woods. Have fun.